Holgaruna versus Felix Auger Eliassime is the first semi final of the men's tournament in Paris for 2022. Both guys have had similar roads to get to the final stage. Runa started the tournament off unseeded and will take on Stan Vavrinka, the veteran, in the first round. And after losing the first set, he had to come back and fight for the win, eventually beating Stan in three, four, six, seven, five, seven, six. In the second round, Runa will take on the number 10 seed, Hercatch, who's playing for an A to B final spot. But Runa would take out Hercatch and take out his chances of making the A to B final. Finals, winning in straight sets, 7-5, 6-1. In the third round, he take on another player who was playing for an ATP final spot, the number seven seed, Rublev. And again, Runa was not intimidated by a top 10 guy, beating Rublev in straight sets, 6-4, 7-5 to advance to the quarterfinals. In the quarterfinals, Runa would take on the world number one and top seed, Carlos Alcaraz. And after taking out the first set and pushing Alcaraz to a tie break, Alcaraz would eventually have to retire through injury. 6-3, 6 all retirement. Ojeel Yassim entered the tournament as the eighth seed and would get a bye in the first round. In the second round, he would fight against the qualifier, Ima. The first time in a long time, he was in trouble and had to fight in the third set in a long match, eventually prevailing 6-7, 6-4, 7-6, 8-6 in the tie break. In the third round, he'd take on the wild card and French veteran Jules Simon, who'd been very impressive during the week beating Murray and Fritz. But Auger Aliassime had no problems sending Simon into retirement. 6-1, 6-3 to advance to the quarterfinals. In the quarterfinal stage, Auger Aliassime would have to take on the number 16 seed Tiafo, who'd been having a good couple of months himself. But unfortunately, Tiafo couldn't play well against this Felix, and FAA got through 6-1, 6-4 to his first Paris semifinals. These guys have actually only played once in their careers, and it was actually this time last week. It was a straight sets win for Felix back then. We all know that Felix is in great form, but also Runa in a little bit of under the radar form, having made a couple of finals in a row. If Runa's gonna win, he needs to do what he did against Alcaraz. Not be scared, be fearless, go after it, come to the net and keep the variety as well. Keep Felix guessing and also move him around a bit because I'm sure that Felix is feeling tired after winning three tournaments in a row and playing a lot this week. If FAA is going to win, he's going to have to, again, use that forehand and the serve combination. Now, he wasn't playing great against Tiafo. There were a lot of errors in that match. He needs to clean that up when he does play against Runa because Runa is not going to let him get away with as many errors as Tiafo let him get away with. This is a very interesting match, and I think we're all asking, when is FAA going to get tired? I don't think it's going to be in this match, though. I think he's going to make the final. He's going to beat Runa in three sets. I think Runa's going to take a set off him, but I think it's going to be the same result as last week. So I'm going to go with FAA in three to make his first final in Paris. But let me know down in the comments below. Who do you think is going to win this one?